the gigs take place in Glossop in Derbyshire. We're in the Peak District and it's a, it's a beautiful area and just a few miles from here in the 1930s there was the Kinder Trespass, a massive act of defiance where people walked up onto the moors where they weren't allowed to go and as a result of their actions you know we now have our national parks. So this is a great area to do something like this. The club where we put the night on has been there since 1906 and it was set up by trade union reps from the mills around here and by suffragettes, women campaigning to get the vote and they wanted to set up a club for where ordinary men and women could go and have a drink and have a good time and uh, we're following in that tradition and so it's great to do the Defiant Sessions at Glossop Labour Club. We run the night a little differently to a lot of nights. We start and finish the music early. Um, so all the live music is done by 10 o'clock. But the night isn't done. You know, we have that last hour up until 11 and uh, we have a dance and we listen to great soul music. I've got Simon Galloway from Glossop Record Club comes and DJs and he plays James Brown and Aretha Franklin and Curtis Mayfield. Um, we call that part of the night soul power. And it's a great way to end because it's always really uplifting. And it means that you can have a chat with the artist, you can buy him a drink, you can buy a CD off him, you can wind down the night after seeing the music and get to know the people who have just been entertaining you. And also it means that, you know, if you've got to get back for a babysitter, you know, we're all getting on a bit, um, then you can do that as well. And Or you can run and grab the train if you've got to travel. So it might not be rock and roll to stay up late, um, but uh, I think it's a much more kind of civilised way to, to run a night. Defiance. 